you might not have another thing to do. But we we'll know, all of us will know, because at the point I will have to, I will have to address, I will even soon, before we present our budget, I will talk to the people of this state, and after the budget is approved, I will speak to them again, so that everybody will know that look, it's not possible for us to use all our money to pay salary. We will be eating our future. I've said this over and over. So we must be prepared to make sacrifices. The money is old. There's nothing anybody can do. To pay it is not something that can come overnight. They say we ask us to go and now borrow money. Another bond. You do that. It's supposed to be tied to capital expenditures not recurrent. You don't go to borrow money to pay salaries. I don't know. But something has to be done. I'm sure I hope uh, your, your report, Mr. Deputy Governor and your members have addressed this issue. So we'll look at it. Uh, look at the way of talking to our, our people so that they can understand. I can want to thank them, I mean, you this forum, because uh, uh, we are here, the press is carrying us. I want to use this forum to, to congratulate our people and thank them for their resilience. I know that it's not been very easy, but I've found out that it's increasingly becoming a bit difficult for government too. It's not easy for the government. I, I, but whatever we do, God's willing, we we'll try not to owe salaries. Because we, I look into this report. I thank you. And I uh, want to appreciate all of you. Uh, please, the gentlemen of the press, help us carry our message out. And carry it correctly. It's not that the governor has said they won't pay salaries. You can say the governor was, of, of, I mean, was a bit hopeful that maybe civil servants will waive their salary <laughs> as part of uh, contribution to development. And that if they meet and say they are waiving just two of the month, we'll be happy. But if they, since they must have the full salaries, want to thank them who look for ways of pain. But we want to thank them for their resilience. Just let them be, as they have maintained their calm since we came in, we want to appreciate the civil servants for this. Uh, it's a lot of sacrifice, I know. But the government will continue to try to make sure that we don't owe them their salaries. I thank you.